very good morning dear children i hope that you have gone through the video in which i have explained and given some incident to enter into the poem the wind before i start to give explanation about the wind the poem i would like to explain about the figure of speech which often used in the poem by the poets to explain and to give the effective or dramatic way of understanding in the poem you may think that what is a figure of speech a figure of speech is a word or phrase that possesses a separate meaning from its literal definition so a word or phrase which possesses a separate meaning it can be a simile or a metaphor a personification or alliteration etc in the first stanza we have metaphor and alliteration the second line i have underlined blow the birds here what is called the alliteration the alliteration is a figure of speech in which a series of words usually two or more neighboring word have the same first consonant sound however sometimes repetition of the sounds occur like a, a peter piper she sell she shore or like work can work or kind king crystal clear so here like that blow the birds it starts with the b the b so here the me, we will and we will come to the meaning later and now the fourth line like lady skirts here the poet explains and talks about the metaphor and what is metaphor here like lady skirts he compare the wind to like lady skirts because the metaphor is a comparison between two two things that share a common characteristic one thing is equal to another because it has this characteristic so the wind is equal compared to the lady skirts here dear children now we'll come to the meaning of the first stanza i saw it toss the kites on high and blow the birds about the sky and all around i heard you as like lady skirts cross the grass a wind a blowing all day long a wind that sings so loud a song here the poet is explaining his interest first he is aware of the presence of the wind a lot of evidences prove that like the kites flying high and even the birds soaring in the sky second stanza he explains i saw the different things you did that always you yourself you hit so what is the different things here he compare he is calling and mentioning like a pronoun you you are here you hit i felt you push i heard you call so you hit you push you call so here is the personification mentioned then i could not see yourself at all although wind cannot be seen but could be heard and felt by the wind works so here maybe we can remember the words action speaks louder than words so dear children here the existence of the wind is felt when the wind pushes him in third stanza he explains that he is eager to know where the wind is wool or a young mortal and he wants to know what kind of soul is wind like o oh, you that oh so strong and cold o oh, blower or oh, you young or old he's asking and thinking whether the wind is young or old or it's a beast of field or tree or a stronger child than me is asking question he had curiosity to know about the appearance of the wind the poet describes the wind as cold and strong in the third stanza the third line the poet feels if the wind is a beast of field and tree or probably a child than him so dear children i hope that you who you have gone through the video and you are listening to my video you get some explanation as the poet had written for the children 
so it doesn't have any hidden meaning here so if you have difficult to understand kindly tell me once again i will explain to you uh, in this video maybe you will get some confusion because i have explained about the figure of speech also uh, because without knowing the figure of speech you will not understand the meaning when you read the literature part you understand directly but in poem sometimes you feel difficult to find the meaning and you ask me says what is the meaning of this means this a little difficult way of understanding means the point used to use figure of speech like a metaphor simile personification alliteration and so all interesting parts in, to know and to get the effect of the poem so kindly go through the video and once again i will explain how doubt please ask me in other class i will clarify with you thank you children thank you thanks for listening